practice hard and um, understand what we're playing for. This is what we've been practicing for all year. This is what our expectations have been. than we've been starting, which has been a pivotal key for us. We, we, we've been talking um, the last couple of weeks of playing well early, and um, we hadn't done so. Uh, this week we came out, got the ball scored on the first two drives. Um, defense was a, uh, was, a, was a brick wall and played extremely well. So we played from a lead, and that was important for us to um, be the front runners and make them chase us. 21-7 um, at half. Uh, right at the beginning of the fourth quarter, they scored to make it 21 to 14, and then we scored three touchdowns in the fourth to finish it at 41 uh, to 14. So, um, think overall a pretty solid uh, outing. Uh, lots of things to continue to improve, but I think um, we need to be playing our best ball going into the playoffs, and uh, this, this, that was a good game to transition into playoff football with. Oh, we didn't block him. Um, we didn't put ourselves in position to be able to do it at home, uh, which is what one of our goals was to play a home playoff game. Uh, nevertheless, we've got to take uh, our performance and have a great performance on the road. Uh, so we, we keep talking about this is a business trip, not a vacation. And um, on business trips, you're there to work. On vacations, you're there for fun. We, we want to go and earn a, uh, a second playoff game. Um, and so just talking about the mindset that it takes, um, emphasizing our expectations um, on the bus and in the hotel uh, from the jump is, 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 is critical. Let's go. Full Watch speed, Steven Seagal. Full speed, Steven Seagal. Yes, you open your hand up. He's a zero technique. Let's go. Put your hands on him each and every time. Good. That's it. Each and every time, Troy. I want you to put him on the track every time. That's your own personal battle. That tackle goes down. Hey, Jackson, go to center. If that tackle goes down, Coach. I want you right here. You be the pull. Hey, turn around. I want you to, hey, I want you to pull like you're gonna pull. Pull hit me. No, I want you to pull like you're gonna pull. Pull him, pull me. I want you. Don't run up the field. Don't avoid contact. You gonna leave the fucking mouth bloody. <laughs> oh, hey, now I'm whooped it, Jackson. Come on, Jackson. Let's go! Let's go! Now you up in the big leagues. Oh, this is your turn right, 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 right. Yeah. Now the big leagues now. Tell me. Now you up in the big leagues. It's your turn at bat. Come on! <laughs> Let's go! Preparation, man. Uh, show up ready. Uh, we've started slow the last three weeks until this week against Plainview. We came out and I felt like our back was against the wall and we answered the bell. So take the preparation that we put in all week and start fast with it, you know. They're going to have a game plan just like we got one. How do we adjust, you know. So uh, my, my favorite games, I tell the coaches all the time, I actually love playing on the road. It's less distractions. It's nothing like you and your brothers against the wall fighting together. You have nothing else to, to run to. It's just you and your brothers. All in. No more half, half foot in. Just believe. Um, we, we we all we got. We will be all we have on this road. It, was, it will be just us. Just believe in one another. Again, I talk about it every week. Something bad is going to happen. How do we respond? That's just like life. Life is going to happen with or without, without you. So how do you react to it? We have a lot of young guys. Most of the guys we took last year are gone. And so you have just you and your brothers. Let's just 
fight together. This is yours, bro. <laughs> That's uh, one of my jobs that Coach Mims has me do is all the logistics. Um, and it's calling 24 hours in advance, let, letting these businesses and these owners know that I'm bringing 106 people with me and I got to have room to feed them all. And it's it's interesting sometimes, you know. I mean, <laughs> AISD makes sure makes sure we eat good. They, there's, you know, they give me a credit card. I never have to worry about it. And it's always cool because we're giving kids new experiences, things they don't always eat. Yeah. And so, you know, when I give them some new meal and I see a big smile on it, and they're like, "Wow, that was delicious." It, it's it's cool to see them grow as human beings. Um, but other than that. Some days it can be a nightmare trying to get everybody fed, but hey, we get it done and we move on. Part of the job. Yep, every day. Yes, sir. Just oh. <laughs> follow coach. That makes sense. This is my most important box right here. Okay. Let's start grabbing stuff. Oh, wait. Let's start grabbing stuff. Oh, wait. Let's start grabbing stuff. I don't know where y'all mindsets are this morning or going into this afternoon about the two o'clock game. But I want to win this damn game. It's going to be a long bus ride back if we don't win. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Defensive line, today they will run the ball. There is no question. Oh, that's fine. A lot of GT pools. Double guard pulls with the full blocks. There's going to be a lot of tackle foes as well. It don't matter if we're in the 4 2 5 or we're in the bare front. We have to stop the run. When we get an opportunity to rush the pass D line, we got to get back there. No DB can cover no more than five or six seconds, if you understand. The very, from Monday through Wednesday, we didn't have a good coming out on the first of our drive. D line, we have to get back there. It's imperative that we rush the pass when necessary. Not only that, the technique will get us there. Regardless of what the situation is, rely on your technique. Got the eight blitz. <coughs> now, we got a wall, right? But we're watching this offensive tackle job if it's a run or pass. It's going to be a game of adjustments, depending on who I have, all right? Depending on who I have to play, I'm going to have to adjust, right? It is my job to put you in position. Don't overthink anything. Let's get it. Throw it all week long. Throw it all week the ball. They come, come off the ball slow, shoulder leaning. You fire for them in their mouth is over with. Can't wait, man. I love the playoffs. You get to wake up and play football. I love the playoffs. I need 
game rest. Ready today. Ah. Fire off today. I want energy today. Everything that happened up to this moment is inconsequential because right now we play football. This is it. We got four quarters to prove dominance. We got four quarters to get our lick back from last year and to extend our season another week. See, when this game is over, half of the people on this team, on this field, will not play football anymore. If we don't go out there and take care of business, do what we're supposed to do, Sammy never wears a, a PD jersey again for the rest of his life. Fight for your brothers. Fight for life in this game. <laughs> Fight for one more week of this season because every single opportunity we get to do this is precious. See, everything that led up to this don't matter. What matters is what we do right now from kickoff to the end of that fourth quarter. Do y'all feel me? Yes, sir. yes, sir. And I want you to fight with everything you got. And if you do that, we can leave with my head held high. If I can leave with confidence, feeling good about myself, and I can enjoy the bus ride back. But if we don't come out and fight, if we come out in a little, uh, something went wrong and we had distractions and we're <laughs> unfocused and we just lay down, that I can't, I, I can't stand that. I can't abide it. Y'all feel me? Yes, sir. Exactly. Fight from the jump and don't stop fighting. Get a break on Sammy. Let's go. I love you, boys. Do y'all's assignments. Go out there and whoop these boys. Let's get the second round. Brothers, come on, three, one, two, three. Brothers, come on. Special teams, do your job. If you're on the sideline, we talked to the young guys all week about going as a privilege. We didn't have to bring you. You're on the sideline with positive energy. Defense is up first. I need to see guys hitting the mouth. We got to start, start the game playing fast. Last year, they came out on the first drive through seam slice. Running back ran down the middle of the field, wide open. Nobody covered him, and we missed it. And they miss it. Expect the trick play early. They don't think you're smart enough to be able to cover that crap. Do your job. Communicate the coverage. Make sure we're echoing it back and forth. Be physical defense. We got to come out and play hard. We got to come out and play fast. We got to come out and play physical. Running backs, we got to pick up blitz. Online, you know they're standing. Two yards from the ball, and you know they're coming. Do your job. You versus the man in front of you. Who is going to dominate? We've been working for this all year. We've been working for it all, all season. Get a break, man. Let's go. Hey, this is going to Hey. Hey, we had a lot of distractions this, uh, this weekend. Let's go out there and focus and do our job. Let's play hard and get this little ball. Let's go. Send me on one. One. Family. Young Gotti.
like, don't do nothing after the whistle. Keep your composure. Keep playing hard. Dodge gonna win this game. I don't think we about to go put seven on the board right now. I believe in you. No matter the circumstance or the situation, we gonna win this game. You gotta go play like it this half. Everybody understand? Yes, Let's have the first snap. Play like you believe we gonna win this game. Yes, sir. Hey. 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 Yeah. 